Hi, everybody. My name is Mary Stiefels. Uh, welcome to the Visual Arts Council Art Show. This is December 5th, part of B-Side's First Friday's event. And I'm standing here with Katie, one of the Visual Arts Council leaders who has work in the art show. Very proud of Katie, one of the artists working on her work up until the last minute, which is so cool. There's actually some artwork here in the show that I think is still wet. So welcome, Katie. Tell us a little bit about your artwork. Um, is this about it? Okay. Yeah. Uh, my artwork is kind of a realistic slash graphic style art with kind of an odd twist to it. I don't know. I've been working on it for a while. I have a self-portrait in there, too. So, yeah. Cool. Cool. So I hope that you get to meet a lot of the other visual artists in the show and see more of the artwork yourself. Thanks for tuning in. Hi, my name is Naya. I go to Washtenaw Technical Middle College, um, and I'm part of the Visual Arts Council at the Neutral Zone. And I have um, created a piece for the art show that is kind of a collage type piece. And um, I come to the Neutral Zone because I think it's a really great creative opportunity, and it's just a really good contrast to being in school. Um, just because here you can just create whatever you can think of. My, na my name's Cameron Cole. I go to Skyline High School. And my uh, art project is focused on the Mike Brown case. I feel like as if people have uh, taken the verdict and been some people have been satisfied with the outcome and some people haven't. And what my picture represents is a city that it hasn't come together yet and the our justice system has failed us as a country so i feel like when i was doing my picture i didn't want to i was gonna draw a full city at first but then i decided not to finish the city because i feel like the situation as a whole isn't finished and that's how i look at it hi my name is iliana balde i am a junior at skyline and a lot of the art I have uh, consists of mainly paintings and drawings that I've done. And I did a lot of them when I was bored and when I had nothing else to do. And I thought, maybe this would be a good idea. And the reason I come to Neutral Zone is because I really love the people here. They're so generous and honest that I just gravitate towards them. And they're kind of like family to me. And I wish, I wish more people could come here, honestly. I just love how creative I can be and what I can do. And yeah, that's, that's me, I guess. Hi, my name is Kendall. I go to Pioneer. I'm a sophomore. I love the Neutral Zone because it's a really open environment and there's a lot of different programs that offer a lot of different creative outlets for you. And I love art because it's all up to, it's all open to interpretation. And we can, it means a lot of different things to a lot of different people, and, but it can also bring a lot of different people together. So. Um, my name is Red. I go to Skyline. I am a sophomore. And, um, uh, my artwork is like right over there, right behind me, all the colorful stuff. It's um, like psychedelic type stuff mainly. Um, I wanted to do it like in a more psychedelic type style because, I don't know, it's like my way of expressing like what I feel like opposites would be, you know? Is that good? <laughs> oh yeah. Um, why I've come here to the neutral zone, um, I heard it was a place for like it was very accepting for LGBTQ because at the time I was um, just I was just coming out I was in middle school and um, I got a lot of negativity for it so I was looking at places in Ann Arbor which would um, be very supportive toward people like me and um, I've been here ever since sixth grade. Hi, my name is Sefer Rahman. Um, I'm from Pioneer. I'm an exchange from Pakistan. It's been so amazing here since four months. And it's really cool to be here in Neutral Zone. I've never seen this place back home. And I'm glad to be here in the US and experiencing this whole event. And I like to sh just to present my art show too, like uh, my art piece here too. So looking forward to it. Thank you so much. Hello everybody. My name is Austin and uh, I go to Ann Arbor Academy. And I've been at the Neutral Zone for, uh, this is my second year here. And my art, which is over there, you can, I, um, oh, I don't know what to say, uh, yeah, why did I come here? Well, 
I get to hang out with other people who do art and admire their art and stuff and uh, create my own art, use the materials here, and uh, and uh, how I created my art, which is over there, is that um, I use, I had, I have like, I, there's like some free sketchbooks in the art room, so I took one, and I um, did some, I started doing more drawing. I used to, I, did, I have done a lot of photography before that, but I did some drawing, and I, I didn't have any like photos in time for like the art show, so yeah, I just did some drawings and put them in the art show, so yeah, that's really all. Well, my name is Ali Shaheen. I go to Skyline. I'm a senior. Um, today here at the art show, I'm actually blown away by one, how talented all the teens here at the Neutral Zone are, the teens in the Visual Arts Council, the teens that participate in any of the visual arts programs, and I'm also profoundly impressed by all the hard work they've done to put this show on, and they do this show, I know they did it last year, and I know they do a show in the spring, and I'm very proud of them for continuing to do this wonderful work and giving these teens an opportunity to show off the talents they have. And in a broader sense, you know, the neutral zone really enables teens to let the creative seeds inside of them grow. And that's why I love the neutral zone. And that's why I come here multiple times a week. You know, um, teens from all walks of life come up here to really let what's inside of them fester, whether it's their poetry, whether it's their music, or whether it's the wonderful visual art that they have here tonight. Um, bless it all, it's so wonderful. I'm Cecilia, I go to Pioneer High School. Um, I do a lot of photography and I really like taking pictures of buildings and industry and so that's a lot of what my art is. And I come to the neutral zone because it's, um, it's fun to hang out with people from other schools and I really like to uh, create art with other people and I also do short story here on Fridays because I really enjoy to write and that's about it. My younger sister Vera is a middle schooler at Forsyth Middle School and she technically is not allowed to come to the neutral zone because you have to be in high school but I pulled some strings with Mary and the, new, and, uh, the board to come in and let her uh, start early and practice art and I think she has a great job and really gets a lot out of being here. I think that her being able to interact with older older kids and get an exposure to it at such a young age will give her a great head start to be uh, a great neutral zone kid in the future. When she's my age and doing the same things, I really hope that she's going to be doing uh, many neutral zone programs, perhaps doing VAC later in the future. And I'm really proud of her doing uh, her artwork and doing photography and drawing and all that stuff. I think it's setting her up for a great future in art and music. My name is Lori Roddy. I'm the Associate Executive Director of the Neutral Zone. And um, I just want to give a shout out to all the young people who helped to curate the Opposite Show. Um, it's one of the things that Neutral Zone is most proud of, for young people to come together um, to identify young artists and to help them find opportunities to exhibit their work um, and be true arts leaders in our community. So um, we're super proud of them and we hope that people have enjoyed the show tonight. My name is Shane McParland. Uh, I'm uh, part of the Friends of the Neutral Zone. Uh, I'm from Ann Arbor, uh, from Michigan actually originally. Uh, just recently started getting involved in the Neutral Zone, kind of discovering what it's all about. Obviously, it's a big part of the community, hosting a lot of events for, uh, for kids and uh, even events for young adults uh, to, uh, to benefit the Neutral Zone, obviously, and also to uh, support the local artists and musicians. Uh, so it's really cool, really fun. Uh, just got here, so I've seen seen some art so far, and it's it's uh, it's really good. It's uh, it's it's very high quality. Um, you know, I th I think uh, people maybe assume because the kids, you know, they're it's not going to be as good as, as uh, like a professional level, but it's it's pretty it's pretty good. Um, also, the music, uh, very high quality. Uh, you know, it's a great great asset to the community, and uh, just glad glad to be a part of it. Gr glad to have found out about it in the last uh, last year or so. Um, so I'm just looking forward to, to spending more time uh, at these events and uh, making, making friends and being part of the community. So, yeah. Hello, my name is Rade. I'm from Indonesia and I am one of exchange students and I'm going to, going to Pioneer High School, and which is I got scholarship to go to USA. 
I have main ambition to be Indonesia ambassador of art. So now I'm just hang out to neutral zone with my friend, which is exchange student too. And then I saw so many things in neutral zone, which is support me to be Indonesian ambassador of art. And which is in this place, I can learn more about American cultures, especially in art. So thank you, neutral zone. Bye. Hi, my name is Katie Cavio, and I'm a senior at Pioneer High School. Um, all my work is up there on the wall back there. Um, a lot of my art is just stuff that I've accumulated in my sketchbook over the past three or four months. It's just a lot of drawings I use to express my emotions because I feel like that's the best way for me to do that. Um, it's usually just like reality drawings or realistic um, with a little twist of fantasy somehow and I just think that makes it a little unique. Um, I come to the neutral zone every Wednesday and Friday for um, back screen printing and Riot Youth. And I really love being here because it's a very open community and it just makes me feel special and like I'm safe and happy, so. Hey, my name's Andrew. Uh, I'm from Skyline High School and uh, I've got a piece of artwork here and I'm also playing the music, which is really cool. So um, my art piece is like a sequential piece of art. Um, it's kind of a dude and there's some stuff coming out of him, but I don't know, I, I, I just think art is really sweet and very important and um, music, all kinds of art, um, visual art and music, because what is music if it's not art with sounds? Um, so yeah, art, cool. Thank you. My name's Eva. I go to community high school. Um, I like to paint in. I like to paint and do mixed media work. Uh, most of my art is stems from various social issues that I'm spend a lot of time thinking about. Uh, I, I, I guess I, I come to the neutral zone for similar reasons to be able to engage in art and social issues and just be exposed to a lot of really wonderful, smart people who, you know, inspire both those things and teach me a lot about both of those things. That's all. Thank you. I'm Grace and I go to Pioneer and... I'm Emma and I go to Huron and Community. And um, I created my art because it is a good way for me to express myself and it like relieves stress and everything. And yeah, I mean, I've just like always really enjoyed doing art. It's like just always what I do. But it was really fun. We did, like, a bunch of, um, we did like a bunch of like street art inspired kind of things with like signs and like graffiti stickers. And then we also used a lot of like photography and drawing and collaging. So. And um, I come to the Intro Zone because it's a place where people can connect and it's a very open environment and fun for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it's a really good place. Like, it's a, just a really good environment. Like, it's inspiring because you're, like, around a lot of other people who you, like, also really respect. So, uh, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Vincent. I'm a sophomore at Community High School. And I'm a, I'm a part of the Advanced Art and Portfolio class at Community. It, it's fun. I'm inspired by art. I love any form of it, really. And that's one of the, my reasons I come to the Neutral Zone. It's just a, it's a home away from home and just filled with artistic people, talented people. It's just, it just shows how influential art can be. Yeah, fun. My name is Chapin and I go to Celine High School. I'm a senior. And the neutral zone is really awesome. There's a lot of cool people here and you come to, I just kind of come because there's a lot of cool art around and I just really like the 3D art. Um, I like to come here and talk to people who like, who have really intellectual thoughts and feelings about certain things. I just feel like I leave here smarter and it's really fun. Like I just love it a lot. Hello, my name is Ivan. I'm a senior at Skyline High School. Um, my artwork is primarily photo based, whether uh, I take them with my own cameras and on my own time or I take photos that other people have taken and recreate them into collages and like a different composition to per, per way a different, uh, a different message than before and to put them into a new sort of art. I also have a couple sculptures as well. I have an installation in the, the cave that we made out of uh, the big sheets of plastic. I have uh, hanging glass into a mobile and presented and projected a projection screen like a video of breaking glass and then took the very glass that we broke hung it from fish wire and uh, had it as a mobile we also 
uh, covered a mannequin in saran wrap and uh, packing tape and took it off into a hollow shell. And that's been working pretty well, actually. I've been here since 10.30 a.m. setting up. I'm the facilitator of VAC, and I've been at the neutral zone for uh, all four years of high school. I love it to death. I've been here uh, for so long, and I think it uh, offers a great opportunity for every kid that comes here. It's great to see all these lovely people here supporting uh, local teens and the art scene and music, and I'm just really proud of everything and all the work that my kids have pulled off.